Stead. Stead can open up loads of space. Stead. Oh, it's a great save from Johnson, but that'll be followed up by Coker and Barnett equalise. Very popular player here. Oh, and Stead is in. Stead is in. Stead is gone. Stead with the breakthrough. 42 minutes. Oh, that's a good ball for Stead. This time he's definitely onside. Stead is going to bear down on Cousins. Stead in the area. Takes it back onto his left foot. And it's in the net. It's 2 0. Stead again. Yeah, it's a great run down the right hand side. He's beaten the defender by checking back on his left, just on the edge of the six yard box. He's fired it. Kick out on this near side. Good header in the air there from Mark Shelton. And then flicked on. Brunt. Does, can he get away here? Brunt flicks across the wall. Hall Johnson now. In towards. something we don't know about the way to approach him but Chapman here shoots Chapman oh! scores come on Chapman he's deserved that hasn't he he yes. has he's been absolutely everywhere for Barnett he's and he's marinating. been rewarded what a goal that he's absolutely again he's talked about his threat and it's an unbelievable unbelievable goal very very happy with that well, Harry Chapman, first goal of the season. He gives the Bees the lead here. Himself on the score sheet for the first time this season. Shelton scores. Calm as you like. Mark Shelton converts the penalty and it's fired it to Savage United 1. Some more work down the left hand side here. Glover back to Brunt again. Oh. Infield to Chapman. Oh, they, they're tough again. Brunt, 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 Brunt. Towards the middle this time. Takes it with his right foot. And it scores! And Zach Brunt has the ball to take home this afternoon. He scored three. Three of the best. Oh, Lovely ball. Here's the opportunity. Shot to the right side. It's in! Beautiful goal! Through the back, it's not the seven from Arnett, and it's Henry Chapman with it. That's why you're glad for the uh, the water on the pitch to let it skim through. Yeah, it's windy out there as well, isn't it? As yeah. as the wind and rain is not a great combination. <laughs> Bit of space here now for Barnett, and that's a good ball in towards the middle. Opportunity for the shot. It's a good shot. It's a good goal. And Barnett, through Harry Chapman, have equalised here at the Hive. Oh, what a goal! Barnett! Get in there. What a goal. Get possibly the winner here. And Reece it's Brown. Reece Brown with it. Play ahead of him. Opts to carry on his run. Crossing into the middle. And then one more time, he's left it, and that's a goal! Fantastic effort! Really good shot! It's Mark Shelton who scored it for Barnett! Come on! And with only a few moments gone between the opener, Barnett find themselves back on level terms here at the Hive. Away only as far as Hartigan. And Phil Coker. You've got a freely two there, lad, just use it. Chip to near post, good header down, and it's a yes, it's steady! Callum Stead makes on. it two, and clinches the advantage for Barnett. For Mark Shelton, he's got close from the halfway line. He does the job from 12 yards.
and he walks over to the home supporters, puts a finger to his lips and celebrates right in front of them. Just to add a little bit of extra spice to this London derby. Well, it's a lovely composed penalty from Shelton. Never looks like missing, steps up confidently. Questions of that back line of Wildstone. Corner comes in all the way to the far post and turned in from close range. And just like that, the away side double their advantage. side to try and put the icing on the cake again Callum Stead just feeding it on the overlap Hobson Stead neat ball through wonderful work and it had to be that man finishing it off Nicky Kabamba back on the field back scoring goals and Barnett are back on top of the Vanarama National League with what's surely going to be a 3-0 win on the road against their local rivals Wildstone but you've got to say, I don't think that anything else would have would have been suitable than a Nicky Kabamba goal on his return to the team. Dean Brennan will be delighted that A, he, Kabamba's back, and B, that he's managed to get a goal. But you've got to say, that was all. Yeah. At the EVB, there's a ball forward. Barnett got it under control. Appeals from offside, not given. Cross into the right-hand side. And very the header by Nicky Kabamba, his first start. You know, so, um, yeah, I think he'll be uh, a bit frustrated. He's got his name in the book there. Kabamba with his first touch. He goes back to uh, Shelton. And, and here is Kabamba, Nicky Kabamba. Nicky Kabamba somehow knocks it in. It goes off in his knee. He's in the right place at the right time. He's only just come on. Kabamba, kabam. Well, how about that? Just come on. Uh, own one. Uh, it's hard to argue against that as well, actually, Matt. There's been a number of good players, isn't there? But um, certainly Kabamba, you're right. He, he has made that difference. A lot of other players have had chances. And they might have another one now, surely. And there he goes. Game, set and match. It's Callum Stead. It's Barnett 2. It's AFC 5-0. And the Bees win again.